you always want to start your morning off on a good foot and we are going to tell you some helpful tips that you can add to your morning routine to make it even better. So owner of Tasty is Fit, Emily Blanchard joins us now. Thank you so much for being here. Oh my gosh, thank you for having me. We are so excited because we've got some delicious things in front of us <laughs> that are really going to help, you know, make a more balanced lifestyle and a healthier 100%. lifestyle. Yeah, I always say, I feel like it's just the small things, mm -hmm. you know, that add up to have long-term benefits. And this is one of those things. So we're not taking anything away. We're just adding something into your um, morning routine. That is easy. So Yes, easy is key it's, here. It's key. It is, and I totally get it. I have two babies, and this is something I do for myself. And um, I'll show you all the little tips and tricks to it makes 30 seconds in your morning. Yeah, um, and I can smell it already. It smells I know, so it good. Smell good. And it really so okay. So what we're doing this morning is we're making a ginger turmeric elixir. And you know, we're just in this culture where we wake up, we chug coffee, mm -hmm. we chug an energy drink and go with our day. Um, but this is something I just always say hydrate before you caffeinate because it is what wakes up your body, wakes up your digestive system. And if you're just always in taking caffeine when you wake up, you wake up dehydrated after a long night's sleep. So this is just something um, that can elevate your morning. Right. Granted, if you can just do water, amazing. Chug some water before you drink coffee. If yeah. you want to squeeze some lemon into it, awesome. That's even better. This is something that just kind of maximizes on that. And um, when you do have time, it's an amazing thing to have in your fridge, in your freezer. Um, and I promise you, you'll see the benefits. Yeah. So what are some of the benefits of ginger and turmeric? Yeah. So basically both are a root. Um, ginger and turmeric is the one that stains yeah. your hands. <laughs> um, and basically they've been used in functional medicine for thousands of years. And they both aid in digestion, bloating, nausea. Um, they're both anti have anti-inflammatory benefits, tons of antioxidants. So honestly, having those in the morning, right when you wake up, that's just, you're doing good for yourself. Yeah. Um, so both are a root and essentially you can find them both at the grocery store. Um, and I get this question a lot, can you use powder form? You certainly can, mm -hmm. but the flavor is so different, it makes it hard for this elixir to um, taste as good as it possibly can. Okay. And then obviously anything fresh. Has it's just always more better. So if yes. we're going to go through the effort, I always say, if you can, spring for the fresh thing. Okay. Um, but essentially, all you have to do is you fill up a pot on your stove with mm -hmm. filtered water. You have your ginger root and your turmeric root. You peel that, and if you want to, you're more than welcome to uh, take a shot at it. <laughs> I'll leave that to you. <laughs> yeah, you're like, I'll yeah. let you stain your hair. Yes. <laughs> um, and then all you do, so you can rough peel, So because we're going to strain this anyway. Mm -hmm. So just get a little bit of that peel off. It truly is not a big deal. There's no science to this. Mm -hmm. You just want to take some cubes of your fresh ginger, some cubes of your turmeric. And I use, if you're making this, you know, say you want to get four or five elixirs out of it, mm -hmm. one root each is perfect. Okay. I'll walk you through a little hack that when I do have the time, I'll batch it and I'll freeze it. Nice. Um, but essentially all you're doing is you're throwing it into your pot. You're put it, you're boiling it, bringing it to a boil, which probably takes about 10 minutes. Right. And then you're letting it simmer for about 20. Mm -hmm. So you're turning that heat off, letting it um, cool down for about 20 minutes. And then it turns this beautiful yellow color. Mm -hmm. And then after that, once it's cool, all you're doing is adding um, fresh lemon juice. And then this sounds weird, um, but black pepper. Now Ooh, black okay. pepper, I know, it's so funny. I love but pepper. Black pepper is something that really helps you to um, absorb all of the, it's really for the turmeric. It helps you absorb all of the benefits of turmeric. Okay. Um, it's just one of those little tips that really can, again, maximize on what you're doing and like, why not? We don't have a lot of time, so let's yeah. just maximize it all. Um, and then all you have to do is once it's cool, you just strain it into your mug. If you want to hold that strainer for me, that yes. way we look at that beautiful color. I, know. I love uh, that. Get you one, and I'll get me one. Yes. Here. I like to drink this warm in the morning. Uh -huh. um, it's just like I don't know, super comforting, especially in the winter. Yeah, and it's almost like a tea. It is. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It's literally um, Which I love to have tonic. any time of day. A hundred percent. Yeah. No caffeine, all herbal. But you know what's also great about this? Now, turmeric can run on the expensive side, um, but you can reuse. So once I say I'm just making a quick batch of this, mm -hmm. you can reuse the pieces you already used. Just oh, fill wow. it back up with water and keep going. Okay. Um, I usually use them for about two to three times wow. if I'm doing it the same day. And then another little hack, if you do, so say you're you know, chopping, peeling, all of this, you have about 30 minutes. Right. 
make it in a bigger pot with more water, and then you just freeze it into ice cubes, um, like any silicone ice cube tray, right. and pour um, hot water over it in the morning and you're good to go. Amazing, yeah. so easy, and it really is cost effective when you think about it too. It really is, I mean, you um, could probably get a drink for two weeks out of this. That's so, awesome. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, so let's your try skin, it. Hair, um, yeah. Nails, honestly, this there's nothing that ginger and turmeric can't do. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it just makes you feel so much better it in the does. morning, too. Yeah, I'm excited. Cheers. cheers. Mm. That's good. Isn't that tastes like a tea. And you can add, if you want to do raw honey, you can add anything you want. Ooh, that's a good idea, yeah. too. Yeah, spice it up however you and want. And if you're a cold person, drink it cold. If you like it warm, drink it warm. Yes, I love it. What a cool little hack. And if doing all of this at home <laughs> is a little bit too much, you do also offer it at Tasty. We Fit. do. Yes, we do. We sell it in these um, little bottles. But, yes. Um, it's so easy, you can do it at home. It's something you definitely can do at home. If you just take a little time, maybe on a Sunday night, yeah. and prepare for the entire week. That's exactly when I do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah the perfect plan. Well, thanks so much for of sharing course. with us. Of course, thanks for having me. We'll be right back. Cheers.